All right. And we're back. Uh, I just went into a little side tunnel and picked up some more stuff. Nothing too fancy. Got a little bit of coal, a little bit of copper. Look how many different kinds of copper ore there are in this mod pack. Copper ore. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six different kinds of copper ore. How many different types of the same element does one mod pack need? Seriously. <laughs> six of them. Anyway, back to what we were doing. Let me grab some food. Uh, steak. Beef. It's what's for dinner. Okay, let's throw these rubies in here. Let's throw these sapphires in there. Coal, redstone. Uh, this doesn't have any value. That has no value. Zinc is nothing. Cobblestone goes in. Okay, so all these ores don't have any values. Let me get one piece of coal. Seven ore in our stone and make lead ingots. So we're going to lose a little bit of value from the coal, that 128. Uh, if this was like a normal cooking kind of scenario, you would normally cook eight items with one coal, but this way you only make seven. But it's forgivable because this ore has no value, and when you smelt it, it's worth 512 a piece. So you're actually coming out quite a bit ahead. Oh, come back. I do that every time. So let's get a bunch of coal. Um, let's just pull a stack. I'm not going to use all of it. Stone, coal, iron. See, so the iron ore, no value. We're going to use uh, two pieces of coal here, which is like, you know, 128 two times. But we're going to get 256 for each one back. So we're not really losing any value. We're still gaining value. These are worth 128 apiece. So the first one pays off the coal, and the rest of them are free, or less than free. They're uh, gains. Same for that copper and that one and that one. All this cassiterite that's everywhere just makes 10. T-I-N, not, not the number. <laughs> okay, zinc is pointless. Okay, uh, the uranium I can't do yet. Uh, let's see, is my chat volume really loud or something? Anyway, so now that we have all these bars, let's put our coal back. Let's put away our pickaxe, because we're done with that for now. Let's put away the Philosopher's Stone. Alright, let's throw all these ores in here. We're at 108,000. And we needed, what, 80-something? 80 83,000? for the energy collector. Let's go ahead and make that. So we need a furnace. Well, our table doesn't know about furnaces yet. Whoa, hello. The heck was that? And like silent creeper? Was that a silent creeper? Well, luckily there was really nothing of value in that chest. Lost the chest though. Do I have Let's go back to peaceful. I can just teach you guys stuff without having to worry about exploding. 
Anyway, our um, table didn't know about furnaces, but we've got one here. Let's just give it a furnace to learn about. We're going to use it for our uh, thing here. The energy collector. We need, uh, was it six blocks of glowstone? We needed a block of diamonds, so we need nine diamonds. Seven, eight, nine. They kind of move around as you lose uh, energy in your table because it takes away the items that you don't have the value to create. Like, even though it knows about the, what, like gold chest plate, I can't afford it, so it doesn't show it to me. Uh. Crap. I need the table back. I mean, the Philosopher's Stone. Let's give our ladders up. Give up the pickaxe. There we go. Alright. So. Nine diamonds into the block. Teach our table about the block. And we need a piece of glass. Which we don't have. And we don't have any sand either. Well, luckily there's sand like right here five six seven and I'm getting seven so that I can uh, smelt them into glass in my inventory with the philosopher's stone instantly and not have to wait on them I just need one piece of coal. I'm gonna lose a little bit of value, but it's all good in the long run. Oh wait, before I do that, uh, teach the table about sand. That's one of the things uh, starting off in the mod that you'll probably do most often is forget to teach your table things and then need them later. So we get our glass, teach the table glass, and we only need one of them. Alright, now Philosopher's Stone, open a crafting window, glass, block of diamond, furnace, glowstone blocks on the sides, energy collector. Now this thing, what it does is it gets the power of light and transfers the power of light into energy for the transmutations. So here's the interface for the for the energy collector. The number counting up is the amount of energy stored in the table currently. And that number goes up faster based on the amount of light that's nearby the table. So this little sun icon on the right uh, is almost all the way full, so it's almost got full power. This one only produces four energy per second at its most. But still, that's free energy. Now, to use that energy for our table, for now, easy way to do it, let's get something cheap like uh, charcoal. Get a piece of charcoal these slots on the left, if you put items in there, and it's only a certain few items, you put them in there, and it will use the energy in the table plus the energy of that item to create another item, and it goes up on a scale. I think the cheapest thing on it is charcoal, and the rest of them, hang on, I have a list, starts at charcoal. Uh, we got coal at 128, gunpowder at 192, glowstone dust at 384, and then it goes up into uh, Project E stuff. So if we put our charcoal in there, we've got 300 points. We can almost get a glowstone dust out of it. See, it burns off the energy. The little meter on the right, it's charging up to the next item. After gunpowder, there's a glowstone. That's worth 384, and it's charging up 15, 16, 17, 18. 
The next item after glowstone dust is alchemical coal. This item here, alchemical coal, it's worth 512. And basically what that is, is four pieces of coal stuck together. It's just a stronger piece of coal. You can actually take that in a crafting table and turn it back into four pieces of coal. But this is how you uh, change, this is how you get your energy out of your table for now. See, now we're at 512. We just take it out, put it back into our table, gain the 512, plus now it knows about that stuff. And uh, let's get some more charcoal. Get a stack out. It's going to transmute. Yeah, one's redstone. So it goes coal, charcoal up to redstone it is 64. And then after redstone, it goes up to coal at 128. So the 64 there, plus it'll need another 64 here. Two, three, done. Coal. Uh, also, this slot on the right, all the way over here with the little like crosshair thing in it, that's where you tell your table, do not upgrade items past this item. So I'm going to say redstone for there. It's just a demonstration. If I put coal in there, it doesn't do anything with that coal. Because uh, coal is higher than redstone. We take that out, put charcoal in there, it makes the redstone, and it stops upgrading. Even though it's got enough points to make coal out of it, it stops there. So I can take those out, take this one back, say stop at coal, put our redstone back in there. So it'll just slowly upgrade and gain energy uh, as long as it's running, which is going to be all the time. At nighttime, the sun won't be up, but this thing actually will run off of torches. There's a torch right there. So it'll still be running at least a little bit at nighttime. Let's get our chest back down for our uh, miscellaneous stuff. I want to keep that. I want to keep our stone. Uh, the rest of this stuff can stay. I don't think the table knows about seeds yet dirt. I can put that in to get the value out of it. This cuts down on storage like a lot. <laughs> this is all I need is this chest, that table, and I really don't need this except for I'm using it to gain more energy which is just free items but very slowly. Just free items, free energy till I can uh, get enough energy to make a second one, and a third one, and a fourth one, and so on and so forth. What do we got left? 14,000 points, plus whatever values in here. So almost 15,000. Uh, if I don't want armor or a weapon, I can have more points. But let's, um, let's get a diamond. and a couple sticks. I'm just going to start teaching my table about tools. Here, learn that. Now it knows about diamond shovels. Um, I don't have enough to get two diamonds out, so that's really the only diamond tool I can make right now. Iron sword's worth 500. It's not going to be enough to make a diamond sword. Let's get rid of all this. In you go. Oh, it didn't know about the iron sword, apparently. Okay, let's get one, two diamonds. And a stick. Teach this thing about diamond weaponry. In you go. Uh, I'm going to need like 24,000, 24,500 to make a diamond axe. I can make a diamond hoe though. I 
that's the first hoe I've made here. Go back in the table. We're not using you at the moment. Um, I don't need to make any like gold tools or anything. Let's see. Let's get. Let's grab our iron. Because we don't have enough to make a diamond one yet. And make an iron axe. And go get a bunch of wood. Because there's lots of trees nearby. And those are worth a decent amount. I'll just start over here. Take the top out of these. Keeping my repair talisman on me all the time. And actually, I could grab some shears. Or make some shears, actually. One, two... Make some shears. Teach the table about shears. It's one of those items that you... Well, one of the items that I rarely use anyway. All this grass has value. Not very much, but... What is it? One point a piece? Yeah. Not very much. Leaves, I think are a bit more valuable though. And before these shears break I want to stop using them so they can recharge. Yeah. I mean they're not super expensive but in the beginning you want to keep all the energy you can until you have a more reliable source. Okay, so the leaves are worth... Oh, they're also one point apiece. Eh, yeah, well. Waste not, want not. Still get the chance of uh, getting saplings out of the leaves. Turn those in for points. But this is a lot of this phase of the mod pack is just get materials, turn them into energy, get better materials, use better materials to make better energy production. Until eventually you can make anything you want, anytime you want, and have all the energy you ever need, ever. But that takes a while. Oh yeah, apples also. What's apples worth? 128. Oh. It's pretty good. It's like an iron bar falling out of a tree. flowers. Uh, these don't have a value, these indigo flowers, but the uh, the dye that you make out of them, indigo dye, has a use later, which uh, I'll probably get into in some later video. Alright, let's head back and turn all these leaves and stuff in while my shears recharge.
and the stuff that has no value can go back in there. There's 25,000. Almost. One, two. Get in there. Let's not go carrying those around. Uh, the forestry mod, the bees and stuff, none of the bees have any value. The scoop does though, and the scoop also repairs itself with the repair talisman. We'll repair it so you can just keep using the same scoop forever. Also, the tree tapper from the industrial craft thing. I think it only has like 10 uses in it or something, and then it breaks. Um, you can keep using that any number of times because the uh, repair talisman repairs that also. Where is a good source of material and energy? Come here, Cal. Let's see, leather's worth 64, beef is worth 64. So out of that one cow, I got... Uh, that's like 200, 330. Not a bad deal. Um, eight thousand nine hundred eighty seven. I can make that. Okay, alchemical chest. This is an, another one of the things you get to make. Here's the recipe. So one of each of those uh, conveyance dusts, two smooth stone, a diamond, a chest, and two iron ingots. Let's look, grab all that stuff. Why does that come up with the word dust? Oh, industrial craft, that's why. <laughs> um, stone. One, two. Let's see, how was it? It was like... Can't look at the recipe while I'm in the thing. Uh, two iron ingots. One, two. There should be an achievement tied to this, if I remember correctly. Yep, storage upgrade. So this alchemical chest... Like, now that I actually don't need any storage space really at all, we've got this thing that has like 104 storage spots in it. So, not only do we not need a chest, now we really don't need any more chests. But uh, this, this thing here, we're going to be using as the uh, a building block for a better item that's more useful. 
like really useful. But not at the moment. In you go. Almost to get that third diamond. There we go. So, we've got enough spare points to make a diamond pickaxe now. But uh, that's not what I was going to make. What was I going to make? The diamond sword, right? Hang on. Oh no, the axe, that's right. Come on, there we go. Teach it about the diamond axe. Get rid of the iron one. Uh, done with all that stuff for now. Bare bones inventory. So we're at 27, just over 27,000 points. It's a kind of a slow grind at the beginning, but this will be faster because I know what I'm doing. It took me forever to find out this table does what it does. <laughs> I was running around looking for ores and bars and all kinds of crazy stuff and needing hundreds of stacks of coal. Get some of that out, actually. Speaking of which, crafting table... Yeah, that's a block. Four of those into that. Yep, yep. Okay. So we're going to go alchemical coal block. I'm going to teach our table about some of this stuff. Oh, come here. And you go, and you go, and you go. And we don't have. No, go back. We don't have a coal block yet. In you go. Um, we got diamond block. There, block. Coal and alchemical coal. Fuel. Mobius fuel, we can make a block of that. In you go. And this other thing, Eternalist fuel. Eternalist fuel? It's probably A. Eternalist. Because it's the AE. Um, we only have enough for a couple of those, so we're not making a block of that yet. How about gold? Never know, we might need a gold block. Uh, definitely can't make emeralds. How about iron? Plenty of iron. Teach it about iron blocks. Uh, what else? Just miscellaneous random stuff, let's see. Give me a stone and a stick. Actually, give me another one of those. Teach it levers and buttons. Save crafting time on those. Redstone. Redstone block. Uh, I've already got the glowstone block. Wait, it's not that, it's one of these.
redstone lamp. And just doing all this doesn't use any energy at all. All you're doing is teaching your table recipes so that you can later pull them out when you need them. Alright, what's going on in here? Got eight more coal to throw back. Twenty-eight thousand five hundred. Okay, let's look up the achievement list and see where we're at here. Uh, build craft. Oh yeah, build craft. All of the build craft stuff is uh, compatible. Okay, so we got that. This uh, transmutation, the tablet, which is an upgrade from the table. It's a mobile version of that table that we're using. Uh, it's very expensive, so we're not going to be able to make that this episode. Oh yeah, the Klein Stars. Okay. So, another mode of storing the energy ex uh, that's not making items in there is this Klein Star. Uh, Klein Star Ein. The first one takes eight Mobius fuels and a diamond worth 24,000 energy, which sounds like a lot right now, but that's just a, a very, very tiny amount. So eight of those and a diamond. Now this thing, what it does is it's essentially a battery. It's worth 24,576 which is the same value as all the stuff we used to put into it, so we're not worried about losing any matter, any energy. When you put it inside the fuel slots, or the, um, the bottom slot here, in this uh, energy collector, what it does is it stores the energy coming into the collector, and it also drains what's in it and stores it inside there. And the EMC value of this item adds that value to itself. So you don't have to worry about discharging it anywhere. You just here. I'm gonna just show you. See the current value goes up, also. All right. So it's now worth twenty-four thousand nine hundred and forty. We can put it back in our table, and we get all of that value in there. And we can just make a new one. So anytime we want to store energy, it's in there. If we want to convert items into other items, we can just take the take the battery out and put our items in there and whatever. But that's the way I'm going to go for now, now that I had enough energy to make one. Uh, when you make four of these, or when you get up the energy enough to make four of those, you can combine them together into the next tier, which is we. It's exactly the same as using four of those at once. Worth exactly the same as four times the amount of energy. It holds uh, four times the amount of energy inside of it, etc., etc., etc. And uh, four of those make the next one, four of those make the next one, on and on and on until you get to Omega, which is 25 million to make. Sounds like a crazy insane amount, but it's actually not once you get down to it. Everything is cheap. This red morning star, best weapon and tool ever. Well, for a handheld weapon or tool. Seven million value. Very worth it when you get up to it. Alright, let's go uh got five thousand energy left. Let's get some kind of weapon or tool and go get some stuff. There, iron pickaxe. Let's go mining again. I guess we'll alter alternate. Let's see, I got that pocket of stuff. Uh, this is the branch I cleared out between last video and this one. I kind of just went and picked up the stuff out of the walls. I probably missed some though back there. Let me get over here. Yeah, this goes on to a different spot. Oh no, it didn't. Okay. Oh no, there's 
I don't know if you can see this or not. I don't have any torches. Let me just grab the couple of uh, copper that's here. And it looks like... Yeah, that's all that was here. A few pieces of copper. Make my way back out. Where you guys can see. Just eight copper. Let's get rid of this marble. There. Oh, there's iron up there. Let's grab you. Yeah, I guess I cleared out this entire thing. Uh, here's some tin. Guess that's all that's there. Come back down here. Uh, when I get enough points to make another diamond pickaxe, I'll uh, start harvesting out all this obsidian. Also, well, you know what? A block of a piece of obsidian. Let me show you here. One piece of obsidian is worth 64 value. That's 64 energy. And a bucket of lava is worth 832. Regular bucket 768. So if you think about it, the lava bucket is just a bucket plus 64, which is a piece of obsidian. So if I just make a bunch of buckets and come down here and grab all this up, I don't even need the pickaxe. I can just convert the lava straight into energy. Uh, this stuff I think has no value. Yeah, that's more blue power items. Boxite, however, I really want. Oh, I got it. It made the sound, but I still got it. Let's get that redstone. Redstone's really good to uh, make energy out of because you get a lot of it at a time. That's 1700 right there. usually get a pretty good amount at a time. It's easy to mine. It doesn't take forever. There's some more back there. Oh, I just remembered a block that we forgot. We forgot to do lapis blocks. I'm gonna skip the zinc, skip the teslatite. This Cassiterite is literally everywhere, all the time. Okay, skip the zinc. I'll come back for it later when I have a use for it. Uh, there's a sapphire I missed. 
more zinc. Some more iron. That's good. Let's see. Um, we can make copper. We can use the iron. Cassiterite, there's a lot of that. Uh, we can condense our redstone down. There we go. More cassiter, right? Redstone, goody. Oh, did I just break open lava? No, okay. There's light from the torch. I thought there was. Lava gonna pour down on me or something? There. Zinc, zinc, more zinc. And it's dark up here. Let me come back for a torch so you guys can see what's up. Copper. Yeah, we're going to have a pretty good amount of energy when we get back. After we add all this to it.
a lot of copper in here. Okay, almost done in the dark here. Let's see. A oh, little bit of iron behind the cassiterite. And a ruby. Two rubies. Two rubies. Alright. There's some more iron right there, right there. Let's get rid of some of the stone. Another iron. Okay. Now it looks like we're done. Back into the light. Let's uh, head back and turn all this stuff in. Let our pickaxe regenerate. Alright, table. There's rubies, redstone, sapphires, coal, iron, tin, copper, the redstone blocks, the cobblestone, uh, let's put away our stuff that has no value, and smelt the rest, I guess. Let me pull out a stack of coal. So we're at 35,200... 35.3, let's just say. and replace the coal so we were at 35.3 now we're at 65.3 so we got 30,000 not counting these ones I didn't have enough to uh, craft with a philosophy stone philosopher stone philosophy stone <laughs> uh, I've got seven of those seven seven of those I can make a few more. Seventy thousand. Cool. All right. I can almost make a block of that now. Oh yeah, definitely. Plenty left over, actually. Boom. Yeah, we're almost at 100,000. Uh, anybody in the chat? Nope. Okay. Uh... So let's see achievements. Dark matter is next, and this thing, the energy condenser. Dark matter, energy condenser, those are next. Okay. So one piece of dark matter costs a hundred and forty thousand. So we're not quite there yet. 
Energy condenser, 42,000. That's more reasonable. So we need four obsidian, four diamonds, and our alchemical chest we made earlier. One, two, three, four. Say what? Did I not tell this thing how to make obsidian? I thought I had obsidian in here. Okay. I guess we're gonna have to do that then. Go ahead and grab a bucket for some lava. Uh actually let me grab a lot of buckets. And a diamond pickaxe. This way we get all the energy value that we need to make obsidian, but we don't have to stand down there mining obsidian all day. We just take one to teach the table about it, and then just convert the rest of the lava down. First though, let's get rid of a couple of things here. Start over here now. Out of space. Okay. Back upstairs we go. I'm gonna put some stairs in. table. This is obsidian. Now let's get rid of all these lava buckets. There we go. Four of those. Okay, so energy condenser. This thing, what it does is it takes energy from things nearby it. <coughs> well, 
actually it won't take from the, the collector uh... let's explain this differently for what works right now uh... it takes energy out of items placed inside of it let's just for example this block of gold and it will transmit the energy from this into whatever whatever item is in the little target slot at the top let's say we want to make diamonds so let's make diamonds we tell it diamonds it's gonna pull the energy out of the table behind it the energy collector and it will start charging this bar up to that value and kick us a diamond so we don't have to sit here and babysit this thing and mess with batteries or anything else it'll just sit here and give us diamonds all day if we put something in the chest that's not a diamond it will consume all of that and give us the diamonds worth of material and the excess is in the bar charging up to the next one and we can just throw them in our table for the full value to be used into whatever we want really but uh, let's see diamonds are a bit expensive for the amount of energy we've got at the moment let's tell it coal just sit there and make coal we'll figure out the rest later so we got 35,000 points left uh, how much is a relay? I think they're kind of expensive 74,000 yeah we're not quite there yet but we're getting there we need another collector don't we eighty two thousand points and we'll work on getting the relay first we want to get this one the first one seventy four thousand alright that's our next goal seventy four thousand um, let's go get some more lava huh Oh, and by the way, buckets and water buckets are worth exactly the same, so you can't cheat the system by making infinite water buckets. They're all 768 each. I don't think my thing knows about water buckets, though. There. Learn it. Oh, I don't have enough to make a lapis block. Uh, that's the one, one of the blocks we forgot about earlier. Let's go ahead and do that now might as well while we're up here there you go learn some things two stacks of buckets should be fine hopefully we find some resources underneath the lava wouldn't mind finding some more diamonds down there. couple of rubies, that's the good. I'm gonna keep an eye on how many slots I've got left open so I don't accidentally uh, use too many buckets and throw one in lava. Burn it up. One, two, three, four. Okay, we should be, be good. Like that. Okay, so there's nothing underneath this section anyway. And I don't have space for that coal. Let's head back up. Let's 
So that's 32 times 64 worth of value that we're gaining. Not a whole lot, but it's something. And it's a lot quicker than digging up the obsidian to bring up. What's our time look like? Oh, just at an hour. Alright, uh, I'll cut it here for recording's sake. And I'll pick the stream right back up. So you guys watching the stream don't miss anything. Be right back.